So when was the last time you saw Mr. Wilson? You tampered with the crime scene? I did not know it was a crime. I did not know it at the time. <laughs> Dr. Seuss claims there was a witch. Got something here, Roberts. Uh -huh. Mr. Taylor, were you aware that Mr. Wilson had recently changed his will? Yes, yes, yes. I met the lawyer at the party. Are you also aware that in his new will, you're named as sole beneficiary? I'm, I'm his special friend. And possibly his wealthy friend. You stand to receive substantial cash assets and a uranium mine in Brazil. I didn't know Wilson was rich. No. Special friend had no idea. That's a new one. People like you make me sick. You expect us to believe that you lived next door to this guy all these years and had no idea he was loaded? Calm down, McIntyre. You just got your badge back. Guys, guys, I, I, forget about me. Shouldn't we be looking for Wilson? Yeah, we'll get that in motion as soon as you give us some more information. Okay. Now, look, uh, Tim. Can I call you Tim? I'd like that. You really had no idea about your neighbor's financial situation? No, no, I mean, he's a real simple guy. He, he eats squirrel, and he's been wearing the same hat for 15 years. Yeah, and that bothered you, didn't it, Taylor? <laughs> Tragic tale. Are you, are you guys accusing me of something? No, no, we'd never consider you a suspect until we had some hard evidence. Yeah. Property of Tim Taylor. <laughs> You have the right to remain silent. Oh, 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 oh. that's a, a Halloween prank. I, I, I just used that, you know, to scare Wilson. Well, perhaps you scared him to death. I am the king. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Taylor, let's run through it one more time. We've got your fingerprints on the back door, a will leaving everything to you. A crime scene you've tampered with, and a bloody axe with your name on it. Okay, back up, McGarrett. Dano. <laughs> you've also got my theory. Right. A witch did it. Right. <laughs> you see, I told Wilson that she was a little nutty, and he might consider breaking off the relationship. Oh, so you're a Budinsky, too? <laughs> back off, will you, Beretta? My point is, I think she's doing this to get back at Wilson, and she's blaming me to cover her tracks. So you're saying you had nothing to do with Mr. Wilson's disappearance? I wouldn't do anything to my friend Wilson. You're killing me, Tim! You're killing me, Tim! <laughs> oh, I'd like to kill that damn bird. <laughs> this one's a sicko. Taking you down to be worth my badge, pal. Easy, McIntyre. Easy. <laughs> Hey, Dad, what's going on? Well, McMillan and wife think it had something to do with his disappearance. You? My name's McIntyre. I'm Roberts. I'm Taylor. I told them about the witch. Tell them about the witch at the party. Oh, she seemed very nice. Can you corroborate your husband's whereabouts during the time of Mr. Wilson's disappearance? Oh, yes, I can. Uh, he was with me the whole time. Thank you, honey. I except for that 45 minutes in the middle of the night. <laughs> Oh, he's in the bathroom. Alone? Believe me, nobody would go in there with him. You were in the bathroom for 45 minutes. I had the annual hot rod issue. <laughs> so for 45 minutes, you have no alibi. Thank you, Brad. I think we're ready to take you down to the station for some more questioning. You can't do that. He's innocent. It said crazy witch. That's the one that did this. Better come outside. There's something you should see. Ha <laughs> ha. Good going, guys. That's the witch right there. Witch? Mary's from our crime lab. No, 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 no. That's Wilson's girlfriend. She's at the party. That's the witch, right? Well, there is a, a slight resemblance. Slight resemblance? Agatha, right? I don't know what you're talking about. What I do know is this is now officially a murder investigation. Murder? murder? No, no. Are you saying that Wilson's dead? Yes, Wilson's dead, and you're under arrest for his murder. You have the right to you're remain not. silent. Anything you say, Ken, will be used against no, you in a court of you... law. I'm innocent. I've been framed here, honey.